KG and Ringy Quick Hitter. Netherlands 2023. In spite of incessant cloud cover, some flight delays, and rain-drenched everything, Team Garrett squeaked out some incredible finds and enjoyed some amazing company during the Kuistra Contest Rally Week in the Netherlands. A mixture of U.S., English, Belgian, German, and Dutch Garrett team members descended on the north end of the Netherlands and slogged through ankle-deep standing water and mud in hopes of finding one of the hidden caches, including five gold coins and five caches of silver. The ringmaster and myself, we are in Holland, the Netherlands, baby, and it has been raining here for like a week and a half straight. We're at a rally, and it is a mud fest but there is nectar amongst the mud. Some, but not all of the gold and silver was found. And on the next day, Leo set us up to go after it once again. Big Kyle. We divided up into five teams, captained by the five better looking team members, hit the fields again, and after pulling up some expected battered coins from the 1600s to the 1900s, I think it was Amaro from Anamique's team struck silver. It was one of the missing 20 coin silver caches, and that catapulted his team into the lead for best coin find of the day. After a handful of worn coins, I finally popped one with a legible date. It was a copper duet from Zeelandia, badly abused by a plow blade, but the entire date was amazingly still intact. 1714, which I think might have been the very first year for that particular issue. Pretty cool, right? All teams were turning in interesting natural finds, including this cool old metal, ceramic pipe parts, bale seals, buckles, a crotal bell, a horsey, and this chicken thingy. Dawn thought she was a lock for the best non-coin artifact with this solid silver watch case, but I thought I had a chance to trump her based purely on weirdness. At the edge of a waterlogged field, I dug this little pendant, and unless my eyes deceive me, this is a pig in a suit. Surely that's got to be a winner, right? Nope. The best artifact actually ended up being an old religious statue turned in by one of the other teams. But anyway, Mark and Opa and a bunch of the Holland Belgium Garrett team ID'd this little guy for me after I posted a reel about it possibly being a random pig or England's Paddington bear. Turns out he's neither. He's Mr. Bommel, a beloved cartoon character from the Netherlands from around 1941. That's way older than I thought. It's a pretty awesome find after all. My fellow team gypsy teammate Etienne was fairly quiet until we heard him shout for joy, as if he had just struck gold. Turns out he did just that. A big fat gold coin which shot us into the lead and we never looked back. Although there were the usual grumblings and false accusations from KG and Digger Dawn, Team Gypsy was crowned the champions, and Silver went to Team Anime. We are the champions. Shut up. The only real problem we had on this trip is that nobody had any fun. Well, I guess maybe we had a little fun.
It was great to see all our Belgium Holland teammates again after all this time. Hopefully we'll do it again right away next year. Thanks to Leo, the entire Kuistra family, the International Detecting Center in Germany, and everyone else who made this happen and made it a ton of fun. Ringy out. Quick hitter.